So we have a little issue with my RC390 and with Natsa. Today we're gonna try to solve it, right? Yeah, because you're drifting a lot, your bike is overheating. Okay. And today we're gonna try increase the airflow through cooling system. That sounds exciting, right? So let's get to work. Step number one is we're gonna take down this stock fan from the air cooling. We're gonna mount these two really strong EXC Enduro fans. They should create a lot of wind through the air cooling. And we're gonna also update it with this aluminium plate. We already measured where we need to position the fans. And now I need to mark where to cut the holes so the air can go through. Holes are cut, not the perfect shape. Later on, if it's working, we're gonna cut everything with the laser. But for now, it should work. And the next step is drill the holes for the fans. Tune radiator is on, all the cable is connected and ready for the first test. Let's switch the key, not so. <laughs> yeah, it's really loud, man. A it's simple it... test, if air go in the right way. Paper is sticking on the radiator. I just know it's really loud, that means for me it's pulling a lot of air to the radiator, so that's what we want. It's time for the first test, but before that we need to put the plastics and the crash cage, and then the RC is ready for the proper drift test. I'm ready, RC is ready, so let's see if we solve the issue with a cooling system. Last time it was holding up for around 10 minutes and then it needed to cool down so I could continue to drift. But this time I hope it's holding up for 30 minutes, so Dominic, stopwatch ready? Ready. Okay, let's rock and roll. even over 10 minutes 11.30 seconds okay for now it's working like last time the bike was switching off and we needed to wait as it's cooling down so we continue to drift 